Hiya. I'm hoping you can see me. I'm on my vlog camera today. Um, I wasn't really supposed to be doing this video right now. But I think, uh, what day are we on? The 2nd of March. Um, 2nd of March today and I've just got a package. Oh my god, it's so bright outside. My eyes are going to water soon. So, I'm sorry. Um, I just got a package. It's Bugs of Goth and it's a coffin. It's a coffin. How cool is that? Right, so I um, I couldn't help myself. I had to jump on. I was going to either do it tomorrow or Wednesday, this video. But I'm just so eager to open this box. So I'm opening it. This is my first time having one of these, so I have no idea what's in it, honestly. Is that like green? Oh, I love green. Okay, there's a red feather. Oh, can we put that in somewhere? Do I look like Peter Pan yet? Um, right, so we've got like green confetti. Excuse all the faces. Oh my God, it's so cool. I love this green confetti. Is it called confetti? Right, anyway. This box, they do themes every month, which is totally my thing. I love themes. By the way, what I'm doing at the moment is just like trying to pull our confetti off the thing. Wow, there's quite a few things in here. I'm sure there's a card in here. Tell me what is in here. But um, yeah, the, the box this month, if I didn't just say, is um, Curiosity, Box Curiosity. I think um so the first thing is this this little like doll head on some pipe cleaners so I'm guessing you can like decorate that somewhere obviously it's kind of creepy because it's box of you know goth um I have seen this online this is um, creepy, but it's kind of cool at the same time. It's jawline jewellery. It's a coat pin. Like, look at that. Does it, does it, like... Like an actual doll's eye, isn't it? That's um, cool, but creepy. What's in here? Oh, got another feather. That one's pretty. Um, I've got something wrapped up in um, bubble wrap. So I'm assuming that means it's like either delicate or there's like loads of tiny little things together. You know, to keep them together, put them in bubble wrap. Something like that. I hope maybe that is the kind of idea otherwise i might be being a bit too rough with this if it's like very delicate um but having something delicate is like not so bad Ugh. oh what is this it's a i pulled out what looks like a shell but it's got some paper with it bat wing shell oh very cute oh Batwing shell. This is oh, that's very cute. Who is this by? Accessory Cemetery. It's so cute. Can you see that? It's got like a little tombstone. I don't know if it's showing up, but it's got like R.I.P. on it. And then like little bones. That's so cute, isn't it? Oh, I really like that. Um, thank you for your support. Is this like the extra gift? I read somewhere something about an extra gift. But I'm new here, so I don't know what's going on. 
a little crystal. I'm in need of some more. I have a little collection behind me, so I will be adding it to that, but how pretty is that? It's so heavy as well. I like that. Obviously, I'm a cliche. We've got, oh, confetti everywhere. We've got this little cross. Now, it's got like holes in the side, so I'm not sure if it's like fallen off a necklace in here or if it's just like they've just given you this, like this, to be like, oh, you can put it on a necklace of your choice. So I'll have to come back to that and tell you if there is like a missing um, necklace or anything. And the same goes for this, but this is really cool. I think you could do this like as an actual key ring as well. Like, do you know what I mean with this little bit here? So it's like a steampunk key. How cute is that? As far as I'm aware, all of these are like handmade as well. Um, they like collaborate with different companies. So that's why I've seen like a few of the things that are in here. What is this? I can't open it. Sorry if we're taking for ages. Is this a fossil? Is that like a shark tooth? I'm not even sure. As I said, I hope there's a little um, thing to explain what it is, but to me that looks like um, like a shark tooth, doesn't it? Could be something else. Squally Corax. Um, phosphate deposit Morocco. Okay. This is so interesting. It's not, I won't say it's goth per se. Personally, I'd just say it's interesting right now. Anyway, okay. What's this? I'm trying to remove all this paper. Sand dollars. Round marine animals related to sea urchins found in sandy uh, sediments in oceans throughout the world. The spines are removed on the shell we've seen. So is this, I'm sure this is like a, um, Another fossil. What? Oh, it's the sh right. Yeah, I just say this. The spines are removed on the shell. We see. Nothing's making sense to me in my head right now. Apparently. Well, I can't open it. Maybe that's a good thing. Oh no, wait. I can't open it. That's so weird. Right, I'll show you. It does remind me of something, the smell. I know I'm not supposed to smell. Oh, it's the bag. I can smell the bag. How silly of me. <laughs> that's, I've never heard of them before. The two-faced skull. Oh, that's cool. I'm really into things like this. Okay. Oh, okay, this is creepy personally, like the doll head thing. Oh my god, I can't open it. What is wrong with me today? Oh, they've put a little tie on it. Right, so we've got a necklace here. That chain's really good. <laughs> I'm here going on about the chain. How creepy is that? <laughs> That's so creepy. Okay, I'm gonna put it back in his bag. I mean, I think Box of Goth is doing its uh, job. I mean, it is, uh, these are curious items. They're very creepy. Oh, I think we've got a little poem here. How cute. Face by Violet Vixen. I lay on my back in my bed looking at my ceiling. It's disturbing how it resembles my face. 
more than my own reflection does. Crack showing through, noting the wears and tears of the body has felt so much pain, too much sorrow, my face has fallen off, piece by piece, and I think to myself, maybe I need a fresh coat of paint. We all feel that. <laughs> oh, coffin box of curiosities. There we go, that's what it is. I've not opened exactly everything, but here we go. Um, Accessory Cemetery Bone Graveyard, which is the little bone graveyard that I showed you. I'm not sure if it just came up then. The antique key, yeah, I showed you that. The little steampunk one. Baby doll with the legs. I'm assuming that's the, um, this one. The Squalacorax um, shark tooth. Knew it was a shark tooth, didn't I? Didn't I say it was a shark tooth? I've got it here anyway. I can't open the box again because. Um, shrunken skull. I don't feel like we've come across that. Unless I'm being thick and it, it might be just left. Um, the bat wing shell. Yeah, we definitely came across that. Um, the Two Face Skull Polaroid, illustration by Breck. No, I can't read that properly. The way that it's wrote over. Um, I'll put it down below anyway. I'll link it down below. So this one. Um, Doorline jewelry. I have my enemy brooch pin. I'm assuming that's that one. Um. Feeling doll choker pendant necklace. Um, now there was the doll. I can't find it now. Um, necklace. This doll one. But that's um, not a choker. Um, a mini wooden cross. Yeah. We said about that. So it is on its own. Sand dollar shell. Yeah. I can't find that now. But that's there. Um, Face Poem by Barbixan. I told you about that. Okay, so that's like everything that's in there. And um, then this, I actually don't know what this is now. Out of everything that I just rambled about. I think it's a shrunken head. I'm assuming it's not a real shrunken head, otherwise that would be creepy. I mean, yeah, it's supposed to be creepy, but I really doubt that they put a real shrunken head in. And I think, as I said, these are all like handmade. So who is making shrunken heads? Do you know what I mean? Oh, oh, that's cute. Oh, I like that. It's really heavy as well. I apologise if we're like on a different angle right now. Um, yeah, well, I'm saying I was just showing you like I got one of those little toy spiders. We're all done. There is a lot there. I didn't count how many, but there is a lot, and the oh, what is my favorite? I don't know. What's your favorite? Comment me which is your favorite. I'm just here looking at which one could be my favorite. I think the oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, I forgot I had this. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm not telling you because I don't know <laughs> useless I'm sorry um so yeah thanks for watching my first um box of goth unboxing um if you like it like this video please and please subscribe because I'll be doing these unboxings like once a month this was the February's box by the way March's box is monsters um so that will be interesting um, I said I love the theme and I do a different theme like every month. So yeah, I'll be doing this compared to everywhere. I'll be doing this like once a month. Um, March is, we're in March right now. Yeah. So I just unbox it for February. And I'll be unboxing March's next month. So if it comes on the second again, uh, I'm afraid this video is going to be late because I will be in Japan. So. I'll be leaving you. What the hell was that? <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm going.